My number one super duper important tip is to look at how you are removing your hair because if you are prone to ingrown hairs, shaving is something that you really want to avoid. Razors just damage the skin, especially sensitive areas like your kitty. Laser hair removal and waxes are an option that's a little bit more pricier. My favorite affordable option is to use hair removal cream. My kitty has not seen a razor in months, y'all, and it's such a huge difference. V works really well. It's such a smooth finish, and it's bomb. Getting rid of strawberry legs starts in a shower. You need to make sure you're using a really good exfoliator. The strawberry and watermelon scrubs are good to use, but if you are really struggling with strawberry legs, you need a stronger product that's going to penetrate deeper into your skin. My personal favorite is this one right here. It has all the best acids and rough beads. Exfoliating before you shave helps you get a cleaner shave. You guys already know that I'm pro Nair, but if you wanna shave, this is a good option. This is shave cream. It's super slick and it helps fight against razor burn and irritation. The irritation, that razors give you is what's causing you to have razor bumps and ingrown hairs so make sure you're using enough of this product it also smells really yummy which is a plus i'm using a clean razor please 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 make sure that you guys are always using a clean razor now to finish all that off i'm using some sensitive skin dove and then we're gonna hop out and i'm gonna show you guys the rest of the products that i like to use Now that your legs are super smooth, we're gonna make sure that ingrown hairs and razor bumps do not pop up. To me, it's easier to avoid them than to treat them when they're already there. So I'm gonna go in with this product right here. Not only does it treat ingrown hairs and razor burns, it also helps brighten the skin. One of the annoying parts about bumps forming is that it often leaves dark marks. So this one is gonna help fight all that. So I'm gonna rub that in on my bikini line. Another product that you can try is medicated gel. This one can be used after waxing or shaving. Some bumps can be painful if it's in a weird spot or you've been messing with it. So this is gonna help relieve that pain and it's also really affordable. The next product for ingrown hairs and razor bumps is 10 Skin. I've read a lot of good reviews about this. Me personally, I only use it if I really feel like I need it. It smells like strong rubbing alcohol. So if you have an active problem, put this on the night before and by the morning you're gonna see some improvement. So now we're gonna make sure that our skin is hydrated so it can glow. I'm using cocoa butter oil. Not only does this oil even out the skin tone, but it also keeps it super moisturized. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.